My name is Tamina Paris, and I work with female CEOs who want to feel relaxed and sexy around men. Because let's talk about this phenomenon that happens with powerful women who are so powerful in the world of business, getting things done, standing strong in what they do and what they bring out into the world. But somehow when it comes to love, there's something that happens where a freezing happens or an inauthenticity happens or a wall happens when there's a feeling of not being able to fully relax into your sexiness, into sharing your feelings, into pleasure, into being able to be seen all the way to your heart all the way to your womb, all the way to your pussy, like the inner spaces of who you are as a woman, you're unable to share that with someone who you're romantically, especially romantically interested in. And I faced this phenomenon years ago when I was coming into the space of getting to know who I am as a woman. And it really didn't make sense to me. <laughs> I was like, what, what's going on? Like, I'm fierce, I'm confident, I'm like on stage, like ha, like really in my everything, my power, everything. But then somehow when it came to someone I was interesting, interested in, I, I, I was like, it's not the word coy, but it was like just something of like aloof or like avoidant or um, I wasn't able to show my interest. I wasn't able to show my heart i wasn't able to relax and be in front of them and be that same person that i was on stage in love and i didn't i really didn't understand like what is this like missing piece for me to really be inside of myself as a woman like in everything that makes me beautiful and attractive and feeling good in my body what changes when I'm standing in front of a man or in front of someone who I'm attracted to romantically? And I also realized that there wasn't a place to really practice this or to really look at this because being a powerful CEO, like you're just gonna keep doing your thing. You're gonna keep showing up to, for your team, making things happen, showing up for your family, holding things down. You guys know about reverse polarity. You're probably leading in so many areas of your life. So when do you get to relax? When do you get to drop into your body and practice? What is it like to really tap into and express your power as a woman? Where do you get to learn how to be connected to your emotions and feel damn good about doing that? You know, feeling like, oh my gosh, yes, I'm fully expressed. I'm fully in my power. Because the thing about this is when you do get to tap into that place and you know how to share that in your relationships, your relationships turn from being depleting, stressful, and just non-existent to fulfilling. You get to be met in love in a way that you get to share your life with somebody and create a life together. And I want that for you. You're powerful. You do so many amazing things in the world. And now I want the world to be doing and giving amazing things to you. You get to be in your power in all the ways. In and out of the boardroom. And also in the bedroom. Because, yes, dear CEO woman, <laughs> we can be sexy CEOs too. So if you are resonating with this at all in any way, I want you to put a comment below saying, own your throne. And then I'll show you the details of a special product, a special experience that I'm bringing into the world very soon. And I know you're gonna love it. All right, see you soon.